Jamia Fields found the upper left hand corner of the goal inside the penalty box with less than eight minutes remaining and Kelsey Weiss made nine big saves as Florida State kept their unbeaten streak at home alive defeating North Carolina 1-0. That was fantastic. I mean uh, we trained it quite often with her coming across the face of the goal and swinging the ball into the far corner and she scored a similar goal not quite the same but a similar goal to beat Duke a year ago here on the field and uh, you know, Jam's working hard and continuing to, to try and improve and um, she was rewarded for her hard work. We do that always in the warm up and I knew like um, our midfielders know to find the outside mids and I knew just cut it in or take it wide. That's, you know, we practice that all the time. I know she's a great 1v1 player and she had someone out wide and she, she beat them 1v1 and she, she picked her head up and she picked her spot out perfectly. So. She, she got rewarded for it. Kelsey Weiss is, um, you know, in our mind, certainly the best goalkeeper in the country. And, uh, you know, she's steady as can be. She's uh, calm. Her um, ability and quality with her feed, her communication and distribution, and um, obviously her um, ability to be a, a shot stopper is, is quite good. So, you know, we're very fortunate that she's matured in the goalkeeper that she has. And uh, I think, again, it was on display tonight. Always phenomenal. Good players. We got Kelsey and Cassie, our two leaders, our captains in the back. So we had another good performance by then. And we had a game plan going into the game, and I think that we came out with a win because we executed our game plan perfectly. Um, in the locker room, we talked about safety versus risk. We know Carolina is a high-press team, and we know that we're going to have to make the decision whether we should possess the ball in the moment or whether we should just play it long and get rid of it. And I think tonight we did a good job deciding when to do that and when not to. We played them a couple times, and like you said, we knew they were going to come out hard, but we knew we, we can just match their intensity and then just calm it down and just play us. And then we knew we could, you know, we could come out and play today. We've been uh, pretty solid throughout the course of the season with our collective defending, and uh, again, I thought it was pretty good. And um, the moments that uh, maybe we were not quite as sharp, um, certainly Kelsey once again was there and uh, uh, played as a tower of strength in the goal and uh, allowed us to uh, um, with, uh, withstand some of the storm. The Seminoles return to the soccer complex on Sunday at 1 p.m. as they take on North Carolina State. That'll wrap things up for now. Lane Hurt, Seminoles.com.